Hello, hello, and welcome back to another video here on the channel. My name is Riley, and in today's video, we are back with Fenerbahce in this Turkish Super League. And up next, well, I guess first we should review what we did since our... I don't even want to talk about how we got destroyed by Man United. That 6-0 loss was a shot to the heart. But then we went on and had some victories in the league. We had three. Uh, okay, let's try to pronounce these. Gaziantep FK, 3-1. Uh, Karagbag, we beat in the uh, Europe, Europa League group stage. Umranesapur, we beat 4-2. Bati Karagum Gumruk, 2 1 victory. Then we beat Union SG twice. So that has set us up for qualification into the knockout stage of the Europa League. So that is fantastic. But yeah, Man United has definitely just gone off. We play them again coming up here pretty soon. And I'm not going to show that on. Like, it's whatever. I I I'm going to play it, but I'm not going to record it because, well. There's no point. We're already qualified, and I don't want to get destroyed again on camera. But in today's video, we are up against Galastere. So looking at the league, we are currently sitting... We have a game in hand, but we are sitting in second. So a victory here will just clear us. We'll still be in second if we win, but we'll be that much closer to the top of the table, Adana DS. Yeah, as you can tell, Galastere is just behind us, so it should be a competitive match. It should be good. Mauro Icardi. forgot they had him. How did they manage to snag him? Oh, he's on loan. Interesting. Okay. Well, let's jump in. Let's uh, let's see how we do. So we're going to go with... What did Pass Riley do here when it comes to uh, lineups? Okay, I think this is fine. Ibanez will be our striker up top. Valencia and Irfan Khan will be our wingers with... Lincoln, Zach, and Sakiti as our three midfielders. Uh, the 4-3-3, the DM has been working great. Alioski, Zalai, William, Arau, and Ferdi with Alte, Alte in net. I know some people have been mentioning it in the past, but Arda Guler, uh, I have been actually playing with him. He's played a couple matches. And yeah, so far so good. And overall, the, the squad is... Is decent. There are areas I'd like to improve, like center back, for example. And I'd like to get rid of some of the other guys that we have, some of the deadwood. But Europe, Europe, Rome wasn't built in a day, so it's gonna take some time. All right, let's let's do this, boys. I'm optimistic. I think it's gonna be a good match, and it looks like we are playing away as well, which is just fine and dandy. What is that? Uh, Guan Mata? I did not. What? Guan Mata is in on this on their team. Birdie now at the ball. Cross is deflected. Oh, Ibane is un unable to get there. Obviously, like their keeper is gonna snag that, but you never know. Mistakes, mistakes happen in this game. Oh no, Icardi! What a shot! Huh. Not a great start. Not a great start. Supporters in the board are hoping for a draw here. I think we could uh, manage that. Mertens, Icardi, easy. All right, let's let's uh, let's not let that happen. Let's keep going. Yeah, now look at them. Now look at them. Now they are ahead of us. Lame. No, why is it all their highlights only now? Come on, boys. Martens. Okay, that was a, a very bad finish, so thank you for that. Martens. Where's Martens, Eunice? Okay, okay. Here we go. Ferdy, Willian, Sakiri. There we go back. Okay, let's go forward, boys. We are using a Tiki Taka, which I'm not used to because I played with the Gagan Press a lot or a variation of the Gary. The Gary Press. The Gagan Press. So I'm used to more high tempo. Like, look at him. He's got his foot on top of the ball, just standing there. Zach. 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 I don't know. Arioski. Valencia. Valencia oh, turns and runs. He's got pace on him. 
Irfan Khan. There we go. To Zach. Oh, there we go. Deflection. Ibanez, 10th goal of the season. That looks golden. That looks good. No flags. No nothing. No VR checks. We're good. We're good. I, I, uh, yeah, I guess it's a little fire in the background. I, pretty sure that hit his arm. It looked like he hit his arm. But yeah, that's something you don't really see in FM. Handballs. Well, that's halftime. Uh, relatively eventful, I guess. Two goals, but for the most part, not a lot of highlights there, but. 1-1, one, one. eh. Against a rival, I'll, I'll take it. Especially when we're playing away. Again, I'll take it. But I think we have another goal in us. Uh, Zalai, Kidi, there we go. Zaich, Ibane, Ferdi, Ferdi to Irfan Khan. Tries to go over to Valencia. Valencia's got space. He's looking. He's crossing it. You got Zaich. Zaich is going to... Can't get a, a good touch on that volley. That's all right. That's all right. We still got this, boys. Juan Mata. Don't do it to me, my man. Cardi. Unable to get there. Ibane. Ibane. Yeah, nice. Arioski. No, why? Why would you go backwards when you had a man forwards? You had Valencia. Forward, boys. Tiki Taka is going to destroy me. This build up play. There are holes. Then he passes it right to Juan Mata. Luckily, we got the ball back, thankfully. Ibane, use your pace. Oh, what kind of finish was that? There was no need for that. You had time. You had time. Just relax a little bit. You had time. It was That was chaotic. All right, time to make some substitutions here. What to do, what to do. Um, Looks like our back four is actually playing half decent, which I'm a fan of. Uh, Takiri. You know what? Let's switch it up to a uh a gag and press, which is less of our style. I get that, but why not? Takiri's gonna come off though. Great bow. Go support. Zeich is not that type of player. I want him to go up. As an attacker, be an advanced playmaker. Arioski, he's having a good match, but he probably should come off. Do I have any right backs? I do. Ooh, I don't want these guys. I don't want that type of guy. Arioski should come off, but my other option is this guy, Hagde. I have not used him very often. And Irfan Khan will come off as well. Because he should. <laughs> That's my reasoning. He should come off because he should. Joshua King, he just needs some fitness, man. Holy. I need to put him on for the under 21s or something. Because he is not fit at all. All right, stop, stop, stop. I didn't get very far, but. Um, so, Zhao Pedro, and then on the left side, I'm going to take off Valencia and put on Diego Rossi. All right, let's go, boys. And then I'm going to throw some encouragement to them, and let's see what we can do here in the final 10 minutes. New tactic, a lot of fresh legs on there, but a lot of variation too. Rossi unable to get there. Pedro is able to get it. Nice. Hugde. Zalai. Zaich. Jao Pedro. Oh, I thought there was an offside there, but yeah. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. Come on, boys. We should be winning this. Well, like XG wise, like pretty similar match so far for both teams, but still. We should be. Ooh, this is a good opportunity. Come on, Zaich. Zach, whatever your name is. <sighs> don't take forever. Shoot. It took that long, and then you don't even score. And then you run away after you shoot. Like, no. You can't just think that you're going to score and then just back off like, oh, yeah, no big deal. No, that's not how we do it. Whatever. We didn't, we didn't win. But we didn't lose either, so I will take it. Against a rival... Can't fault your effort. That's where rival matches go sometimes. Yeah, and we played away. We were the away team there. 
So I, I'm gonna I, I'm this is a this is a W for us. Not an actual W, but I'll, I'll take it for today. All right, so I'm gonna leave this video here for now. Something that someone in the comments can let me know is what is the deal with us making money every time we win or draw a match? I know more wins is like, do we not get a lump sum like in other leagues at the beginning or the end of the season? Or is it just like you get paid as you go? Uh, just, just curious more than anything. Um, yeah. And I'm happy they're enjoying life with me. I am happy to be in Turkey. So far, so good. Uh, but yeah, I am going to leave this video here. And honestly, we're probably going to play ahead quite a bit because November, most of December is a write-off because of the World Cup. And we'll probably come back beginning of January sometime. Don't know when, but beginning of January. So stay tuned for that. But thank you very much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, leave, leave, leave a like, leave a comment. Let me know what you think, and I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye. Mm -hmm.